And now at 5.30, for the first time, students are speaking out after a 17-year-old high school student was killed while jogging. Police say the 23-year-old Maria Rodriguez hit Justin Rivera with her car and never stopped to help out. She's out on bond today. CBS 4's Deborah Souverain joins us from the scene where the victim was found Friday. Justin Rivera's tragic death isn't only affecting those who knew him personally, but those who knew of him as well. Students tell me that he's known as a dedicated athlete, which makes how he passed away out here even more heartbreaking. The images from the scene are heart-wrenching. The impact so strong, it knocked the 17-year-old athlete out of his sneakers. He was in school like us, like it could have happened to anybody. Students at Miami South Ridge knew Justin Rivera as an athlete. And he probably was just working out to get himself better at football. In fact, according to police, he was jogging here along Southwest 152nd Street when he was hit and killed by 23-year-old Maria Rodriguez. If you saw he was injured and needed help and you didn't do anything, well, like, why would you just leave him there? It's a question students we spoke to had on their minds. Why didn't she stop or call for help? I was feeling bad for his family because uh, he got killed. And he probably was a sweet person. He didn't do nothing to nobody. Police say Rodriguez kept driving, leaving the teen on the side of the road to take his last breath. Saturday, hiding her face, she walked out of jail on bond. She's a, um, a coward for killing somebody and going home and covering up the house and stuff. Maria Rodriguez has been charged with leaving the scene of a deadly crash. Now, if you would like to help the Rivera family, a GoFundMe account has been created. We're in Southwest Miami-Dade. I'm Deborah Souverain, CBS 4 News.